Hello again. Just got back from my fishing trip with Joseph and he taught me a very valuable lesson today that I will not soon forget. Um, but that's what this channel's about, guys. We're, we're trying to learn and grow in this sport. So I think you guys are gonna like this one. Stick around, check it out. Goodness. Woo <laughs> I told you I had a good one <laughs> On a whole shrimp? Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <sighs> that was a good way to start the morning. Wow. Watch his dorsal fin there, yeah. He's close to 20 pounds. That's a pretty one right there. Heck yeah, man. I've never eaten one that big. I've got them like 12 or 13 of the biggest. So. Yeah, they're they're not the best. So. I'll, I'll take it. Now let's go and start the morning. Keeper. Yep. Slop. Nice. Redfish like shrimp. He got both hooks in his mouth. Probably 22. 20, a little under 22. Pretty redfish. That's a keeper. That's a keeper. 40 counts for like $3 a pound. <laughs> Dirt cheap. All right, right off the boat. Yep. That's a good stinky crab. That'll be good. You're trying to put that 78 pounder. Not not trying. I'm trying to put 78 pounders.
<laughs> Every dog has his day, Joseph. <laughs> and a red. Alright, I'm gonna steal some of your shrimp. <laughs> I like this size too, 15 to 20 inches. It's like cream. Perfect eating size, yeah. Oh yeah. I think, I mean, I would say black drum probably freeze for six to nine months in freezer bags where you can still eat them. I know you eat most, you eat most everything fresh as you can, right? Yeah. Most stuff I freeze, I give away. It's amazing that we're not getting picked by trash. Just caught this one toad. A couple, no, I, couple I of black bass. bass. I caught three bass because you count the one I caught with a black drum. <laughs> No, I mean, I've, I've only dropped a couple times. I don't want to use your bait up. Why? I got, I got live bait over here. Let me get something.
What did I say? You win some, you lose some? Yeah. They have beautiful meat on them. They're just so bony. that huh should brought more shrimp yeah 10 minutes of fun <laughs> I was not expecting it to go that quickly <laughs> I'll take it so I brought the same place and the other shrimp it's not even eight o'clock yet man <laughs> so what's up bicentennial <laughs> pretty much That was definitely a sheep's head. Oh my. You just using them or busted them? I busted them just gently. Just a gentle bust. That was a good bite. Good bite, man. They're here. Sad, sad man. Great tragedy over here. Don't worry, I'll catch one that's like six pounds and you'll catch a ten pounder make it to like a bum. Yeah. Don't mind. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> That's, that was the fish. Yeah. That was the man with the white stripes. There's a school of them down there. Yeah, that's an eight pounder. Marco Sargus Rex? Oh no, <laughs> gross. Yeah, I don't know, they, they always, yeah, that's an eight pounder. It's pretty thick. Come on now. Mmm, they're nice. 20 to the fork. Yeah, well, I, he's at least seven. I mean, I, I usually get. That's a pretty one, bud. Well, I'll just watch you catch him today. Look how thick he is. That might be an eight pounder. Dude. Yeah, he is. That's, That's that fall. That's that fall fish oh. there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where's the 10 at? All right. 
Spanish. That's Spanish. That was both. That's a stuff now. That's Albies. Oh, there he is. I'm gonna reel this other rod up. That's why I had a castmaster tied on, buddy. Yeah, it's that time of year. Oh, he came off. Dang it. Did he? Yeah. Son of a gun. Here's the down there. Dang, sorry about that. Oh. Ah. Oh, that was exciting. October's a funny month for fishing. You know, we, we've been having these freak high tides. I'm I'm sure if I would have had mud crabs, I would have got on those black drum today, but I I just couldn't get any. The tides have been too high and, and couldn't find any fiddler crabs either. So um, from now on, I'm gonna have some shrimp with me in October. And I know, I know they work good in November and December, January when the water gets real cold, but uh, those fish are, are big enough to bully any, any trash fish out of the way. Um, as long as they're there, you can get into them as we learned today. So um, hope you guys enjoyed this. We'll see you next time.